Here one is a question on exercise 11.3, fourth question. This is from Perimeter and Era chapter of class 7. The question is, a gardener wants to fence a circular garden of diameter 21 meter. Find the length of the rope he needs to purchase if he makes two rounds of fence. Also find the cost of the rope if it's cost rupees 4 meter, 4 per meter. Take pi is equal to 22 upon 7. Okay, so what is given in the question and what they are asking us to find out? They have given that a person has a garden which is in the shape of circle, okay, circular garden and the diameter is 21 meter. So they have not given radius, they have given the diameter of the circular garden. Diameter means this one. The longest chord is called diameter. So this is a diameter which is 21 meter. And they are asking us to find the length of the rope he needs to purchase to make a fence. So he want to put a fence around the circular garden. F fence means here, the boundary of the circle. We also know that boundary of circle is nothing but the circumference of circle. That is, in other figures, we wouldn't call it as perimeter. In this case, it's called circumference. So we have to find out the circumference of circle. Okay, that is nothing but where he, he, he going to put the fence. And he gonna put two rounds of fence. So whatever circumference we got, we have to make a double of it afterwards. All right. So let's start solving. So first we're gonna find out the radius, and then we're gonna find out the circumference. That is length of the rope he required. All right. So let's start the solution here. So what is given? They have given diameter is equal to twenty one meter. Now we want radius. We know that radius is half of the diameter. This is radius and this is also radius. From the center to the uh, a point on the circumference is called radius. So we have a two radius or when you add two radius it gives a diameter. Right? So how to get radius then? If I divide the radius, if I divide the diameter by two, I'll get the radius. So R will be equal to 21 by 2. So radius is half of the diameter, this half, right? Okay, now we have to find out the circumference of the um, the circular garden. So circumference will be nothing but, I'm going to write the circumference with the capital C, it is denoted by capital C. So C is equal to 2 pi R. Now let's substitute the value, so 2 into, now in the question they have mentioned to take a pi value as 22 by 7, so let me substitute that. 22 by 7 multiplied by radius. Radius are going to take it as here 21 by 2. So you can convert 21 by 2 into decimal. What happens here is the answer will be uh, in decimal and it will gonna make more complications. So it's better you can just leave it like that because the numbers will get cancelled easily. So 2 and 2 will get cancelled. 7 and 21 will get cancelled. 7 ones are and 7 threes are. And what we are left with, so 22 into 3 is 66. So from here we got 66 meter is a circumference of circular ground, circular garden. Now that is only one. We have to find out twice because he want to put two rounds of the fence. So from here we can write down. So this is the asking us to find out the length of the rope, right? So length of the required rope will be, let me write down here. So length of the required rope is equal to twice. Since it's two rounds, so I'm multiplying with two. So two into the sixty-six. So two into sixty-six meter because he want to put twice uh, two rounds of the fence. So this will become, when you multiply, it will become 132. So 132 meter. So total fence he required, the rope for the fencing he required is 132 meter. That was first part of the question. Now second, they are asking us to find out the cost. They have given that if per meter, that is 1 meter, the rope is 4 rupees, then how much it will cost? So total meter we have here is 132 meter. For 1 meter, the rope is 4 rupees. So for 132 meter, what will be the cost? So we have to just multiply with 4. 
so let's solve the other part so from here we can write down cost of 132 meter so cost of 132 meter rope will be equal to rupee is 4 so 4 rupees multiplied by 132 so when you multiply this we will get the answer as rupees or you can write down yeah rupees 528 so this will be the total cost so that's it we have solved the problem i hope this is clear now in case you have a further question or doubt you can drop a comment below thank you so much for watching